why well you already know that these are vowels some people say vowels some people say vowels well they both are correct everyone has their own way of speaking that's okay so now all these vowels have two sounds two basic sounds which we usually use in reading okay so the first sound is the long sound and the second sound is the short sound each of the vowel has long sound and short sound both well there is a sign to tell that which is the long sound and which one is the short sound when you will see a sleeping line on top of any of these letters these five vowels so it means you have to speak the long sound of it and long sound is the name of the the letter name of the letter is the long sound and when you will see the small arc on top of any of these vowels it means you have to speak the short sound short sound is the actual sound of the letter well actually when you are reading any word you don't see any of these signs on any of these vowels the sleeping line and the arc you don't see it anywhere you will only see them in dictionary okay but i am just telling you in case if you have to take out the long sound of any of these vowels or the short sound of any of these vowels then how to say correctly now let's do the long sound first just repeat after me a e i o u now let's read the short sound please repeat after me a e i o o please practice the short sound more because short sound is little tricky than the long sound so when i am saying a make sure you open your mouth the way i have opened my mouth a e so you have to put a break you have to throw something like this e e now this is not the action you have to do i am just telling you how you have to speak you have to the way you throw something as if you are throwing something you have to say it in that way e e i i for e also you have to pretend as if you are throwing something i i o o o now this is the most relaxing sound o o now watch this video again and learn and repeat all the long sound and short sound after me bye bye for now